are we today? Where are we today? <laughs> Marcus County reporting in the rain, a little bit of a rain. And we're visiting the one Jeffrey Epstein. Here he is. We're down here in the Southern District of New York. Where all the cops are, where all the courts are. Everybody's here, right? So, Conti was right again. Epstein is, uh, there's his information. There is his uh, inmate registration. Right? And where is he? MCC. Manhattan Metropolitan Correctional Center. Ooh, ooh right there. So, that is the home of 792 inmates. Uh, if you follow this channel, you remember Cesar Sayak was there, right? So I'll take a walk around. It's raining. I'm going to grab my umbrella in a second, but I just want to read while I'm under this tree. So Metropolitan uh, Correctional Center, MCC, right? That's where Epstein is right now, confirmed, because of the, the record online. If you look it up, he's in there, right? And he's going to make his way. We're not going to see him come out of, the, out of the jail or any, you know, dragged into court. He's going to go pass through in an underground tunnel to 500 Pearl Street right here. Right? And that is the court. And you can see it's a monster of a court. It's a monster of a building. This is where, this is the Southern District of New York. This is, this is, the, <laughs> this is the frying pan right here. Right? It, it, I, I've, do you remember the, the I, I've put out the saying before, right? I used to be a musician, and there was a sign in uh, CBGB's right downtown, right? and if you played there in the in the locker room, you would see the sign, and it said, it said, out of towners, remember where you are, <laughs> right? As if to say, this is New York, man. These people don't fuck around, so. What does that mean, right? I want to. I'm going to put out a working theory on. I'll put out a working theory in a second on what I think is going on. Why Epstein? Why now? All right. That's that's the shit, right? But I want to put on uh, one other thing. We already know that 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 uh, Epstein is a serial pedophile. We know that, right? There's no. I don't think that's disputable. He's already convicted of doing it, right? 30, 30 witnesses willing to line up to get him, right? But here's something new, right? Let's, let's begin the, the deep dive. Let's begin the working theory of who, who's going to take the hit, right? Uh, is, it a, is it a left? Is it a hit from the left to smear Trump as a buddy with a, a, a convicted pedophile where Trump is on the record in photographs, on the record saying, I, lo I like this guy. He likes the little, you know, he likes young girls, right? Trump's on the record saying that stuff, right? So is it a hit from the left or is it, I know, I know the, the, Q, the Q team wants to say that, no, 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 this is the sealed indictment we've been waiting for. This is where, where William Barr and Trump round up all the pedophiles and all the criminals. Is that the case? Is that what's going on? I don't know. But here's some, I, 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 I do, I have an opinion. I'll tell it to you in a second. Uh, so the daughter of ex-FBI director Comey is a prosecutor in this case. What? <laughs> Fucking, her name is Maureen Comey. She's been at the Southern District of New York for since 2015. James Comey held that same position from 1987 to 1993. Right. So what does that lean? This is, is, is the, the prosecutor of, the prosecutor who's, who happens to be the daughter of the disgraced FBI agent that, that Comey, that uh, Trump fired? Uh, is she going to lean, she's going to lean right? She's going to lean in favor of Trump? Hell fucking no. Uh, that's just one, that's just one bit of evidence. I'll walk around the front too. There's a lot of fake news out front. They're, they're just starting to get together. But this is the cooler spot right here because you see it. It's Pearl Street, right? This is where Martha Stewart got walked up the steps. Actually in the front with uh, Comey, you remember, for a little insider trading. But let's look at the jail. You can't get too close to it because you, the second you step within five feet of the building, you're surrounded by police. <laughs> That's always fun, but we already know that we already know what's going to happen. So I just want to show it to you. So this is uh, it's an attorney building. I'm going to give you that theory in a second. Just bear with me. All right, so 
the attorney building is here. That's where the attorneys walk through across what's called a bridge of size into the jail, all right? And in the jail, they then make their way into the into the actual courthouse. There's the actual courthouse. Right? There's no bridge of size. There's no there's no uh, bridge connecting the two. It's underground, confirmed. Uh, it's confirmed that all of that is underground. So, so there. This is the this is the jail. This is where this is where Mr. Mr. Billionaire, Mr. Lap of Luxury, Mr. You know, a, a new teenage girl every ten minutes, Mr. Being served hors d'oeuvres with white gloves, Mr. Flying on his Learjet from France. That's where he's spending his night. Do I think he's going to get out today? No. No way. No way. He's he's in there. They got him. And they ain't, ain't going to be no bail. They ain't going to be talking no talk about bail today. That's going to be set for a later date. Probably the fifth, uh, probably five days out, ten days out. Depending on how uh, slick his lawyers are. Now, I know there's a lot of people watching. They think Der Dershowitz and all those guys are going to come in. But those are those are smeared characters. How, how you know, and, and, and Epstein has only had a few, uh, a weekend to figure this out. So who the lawyers are, we're going we're gonna to find out all that. I'm probably not going to go inside. There's plenty of fake news. It's going to be very crowded. In, in recording this, it's early in the morning. It's like 8, 8 a.m. Right? And um, here's the, uh, that's how you get into the court. Right? You, there's no cameras in the court. So even if I go in, I can't, I can't film. All I got to do is write everything down really quickly. Let fake news do that. That's what they're paid for, right? Fuck that shit, man. <laughs> so, so I'll show you the front of the building and then I'll give you my theory, right? The things that we know, right? It's political. It, it is a polit It's political football. That's what this is. This is going to be, in my view, this is, we'll call it Pedogate. That's what it is. This is Pedogate. We're done with Russiagate. Now we're going to move into Pedogate. And try to smear, my thought is we're going to try to smear the president as a pedophile. That's the that's the that's the left play. Right? That's the play on the left. So the road's pretty beat down, but you see fake news is starting to pile up over here. Same shit as yesterday. You got channel two, channel four, channel seven, all fake news, right? So I'm going that way. <laughs> Cat's coming after me. So let me get out of here. The police get very uptight. <laughs> When you don't, when you don't walk the the proper line. So, is it a, is it a, a hit from the left or is it a hit from the right? Right? Who's hitting who on this one? Is it that big or is it just something incidental? It's just rounding up. They just felt like rounding up a pedophile. They said, "Oh, it's fucking. It's time to go. This guy's bad. We're gonna round them up." No, that's not that's not where you are because this is the Southern District of New York where money talks, and and Epstein has a lot of money. And he ain't getting out of it, right? He has, he's not getting out of it right now. So it's political. Just like with Caesar Sayoc. You said, why did they bring Caesar Sayoc all the way up to the New York Southern District? Because this is the crap table. This is where shit happens. <laughs> this is the fucking most corrupt, the most corrupt fucking system in the world. Right? Who's going to pay who? Who's going to frame who? Now you got James Comey's daughter. <laughs> hey, look, it's Jason Goodman. It's Jason Goodman, everybody. Hey, Jason. Look at shit. Sorry. <laughs> it's Jason Goodman attacking me with an umbrella. Wait a faggot. <laughs> we got him. We have triggered. We have triggered him. I don't know. I just said hello to you. You said hey faggot is what I. I said hello to you. Yeah. Now I said now I said hey faggot. Uh, so faggot Goodman, that was fun. <laughs> that was funny. So, he attacked me with an umbrella. Jason Goodman, fake news, attacked me with an umbrella. You saw it live. You saw it live. You saw it live. Uh, so, I digress. That was pretty funny. So, did he knock my microphone off? No, I'm good. Hold on a second. Hold on a second. I don't want to miss a word. I don't want to miss a word. So, 
attack from the left, right? Is it an attack from the left? Yeah, because Acosta, Acosta, right? That is the current labor uh, guy, right? He's the current secretary of labor under Trump. And he was part of the sweetheart deal. So reach, research people, if you, if you want to dive in, this is where you dive in. What is, what is Acosta's connection to this case? Why did, why did Epstein get that sweetheart deal in 2002, 2005? Why did he get that, right? He got it because somebody gave it to him, right? Now, that's the, that's the left smear, right? To, because, because Trump is, because Acosta's to the, to the right of Trump, right? Acosta's to the, to the right of Trump, and so therefore Trump is guilty by association because Epstein's a pedophile, a known pedophile. For me, this case is not about, well, Epstein... Is Epstein, you know, a pedophile? That's 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 known. Should he do time? He should have done time before, right? That's already a given. What this case is about is the political football that's going to begin to unravel, right? The beginning to the beginning of political football season. Is it a hit from the left? Yeah, I just told you why. Now, is it a hit from the right? Right? Is it a hit from the right and try to pin Bill Clinton? That whole theory, Bill Clinton, bulletproof Bill Clinton, that will never spend a day in a, a, a day in his life in jail. Right? Never spend a day in his life in jail. And Hillary Clinton, Bill Clinton, who has been on on Epstein's, uh, you know, Lolita Express twelve to- uh, twenty six times, has been on his on the on the plane. Right? So is it the left? pinning the right or is it the right pinning the left here's my assessment I'm, I'm gonna lean I'm gonna lean that the hit is coming from the left because of where we are because of where we are we are in the southern district of New York it's still raining out <laughs> right we're in the southern district of New York that's where we are that is the FBI building over there on Center Street that big old building right there is FBI. All right? This is state court. These are all the federal buildings, right? Southern District of New York. The lead, one of the prosecutors, I don't know if it's the lead prosecutor, is James Comey's daughter. James Comey also held that position. Right? What does what does the left what does the right get out of this? I don't here's the other thing. I don't think that Trump is I don't think Trump is evil enough, right? Bad, a bad person enough, or has a motive to throw, to throw his former friend under the bus. That's in New York. That's 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 in poor taste, right? That's in poor taste. Nobody. Why would Trump want to do that just for no reason, right? right? Why would Trump want to do that? Trump, Trump. That's that doesn't make sense to me. Why would? Uh, all of a sudden, to then why to pin Bill Clinton as a rapist, as a as a child molester? That's one possibility. But we already know that creepy Bill Clinton. Who's Bill, creepy Bill Clinton anyway? He's almost obscure at this point. See, it seems like it seems like the political ramification is a hit from the left. It's pedogate. It's just they ran out of Russiagate. Now it's pedogate leading into 2020 to try to smear Trump. As having an association with with a with a with a convicted pedophile, and then hiring the guy who gave him the break as his labor secretary. That's more of the way I see the story going. Now I don't I don't have you know that's not my my political bias. That's just my my opinion of what I've seen so far. So. So today we're going to find out the this the, the indictments will be in, uh, unsealed. We don't know exactly who's involved or or what's going on in terms of new and new uh, new information. But we're going to find it out. I'm not going to go inside. So by 12 o'clock today, by noon today, we should know all that stuff. If there's 10 fake news inside in the courtroom, we'll know 
we'll know reasonably sure the truth. We don't have to. I don't have to sit there and 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 spend ten hours trying to fuck around in their system to get in and out. <laughs> it's a pain in the ass. As far as lawyers coming out and speaking to the press, I don't think that's going to happen either. The action is going to be in that courtroom today, probably around 10 o'clock. It's not going to delay. It's going to be packed with, it'll be interesting what guests are there. You know, if there's anybody important sitting on, on um, Epstein's side. So we'll know all of this by about 2 o'clock, but, by 12 o'clock. But, we're not, but, but the, the fact is, which way is, who's kicking the football? That's what we want to know. Who is kicking this football? Marcus Conti reporting.